What is going on you lot? Midi here. We've done it. We've finally reached the maximum level in this damn game. What do I get? Do I get a reward? Do I get an achievement? No, I just get told to touch grass. Curious what's going to happen with this, like whether they're going to reset everyone's levels, maybe there's going to be a, some sort of seasonal thing, I don't know. But what I can tell you is I've got enough points now to max out anyone, hey listen. I think getting the highest level is the easy part, the hard part is actually leveling up your perks to free. But I thought, you know what, let's jump into a few games with Sunny. I know a few of you like seeing me play him. For my casual little build that I like running on Sunny, I go for jump start. I like rolling with stunt double, and then for my third perk, I'm messing around with Sanguine Shadow, is that how you say it? Sanguine. For his abilities, I like to get the shorter cooldown, increase the range by 25% and then of course let the players identify if a noise was made by another victim or family 34 points into the toughness we got 37 into endurance look that's it that's pretty much the build i do want you guys to let me know what your favorite perks to be running on sunny is if there even is sunny mains out there i'll show the skill tree anyway just because i know some of you guys tell me off this is it and i've just got a few good games of sunny that i wanted to showcase so let's do it let's jump to a few games let's actually touch some grass in the game as always make sure you guys leave a like on the video support the channel and let's do it all right let's do it with sunny now, I've been changing around his perks a little bit here, so I'm trying to level up Sissy's little poison perk as well. And we're good. We are good to go, boys. All right, so we do have Johnny and Sissy on the team. Now, if you're going against a Johnny and Sissy combination, you need to not wake up Grandpa early on. Neither of them family members need any preparation, you know. You should sort of see who you're going against in the lobby and then plan your escape route. So if it's a sissy and a Johnny, then we know that there's not going to be that many lock pads. But if you're trying to go for something like Valve, then them two can defend it really well. So try not to wake Grandad up early. Okay, let's use ability here. Just trying to keep my eyes on the leather face here. Another reason why his ability is really good. What's about that? Without? So yeah, them two family members, they have no prep. If you wake Grandad up, they're going to be basically minute one. That's what you got to do. You just got to be careful. Don't make noise. Just stay for a second till he actually leaves. Man, I do like playing so... We good. We good. Oh, baby, we good. Okay. You see how when you're in a shadow like that, it turns down the saturation of the character a little bit. It just makes it easier for you to actually hide and the killer's not to spot you it's like I blended in with the wall. You turn into a chameleon. It's great. Well, let's actually try and get out of it now. But Sonny's just one of them characters that I like personally playing. Because half the time, no one picks him. And if no one picks a character, I just think, you know what? If you master him, at least you're guaranteed to get him every game. Well, that'd be good. But obviously, you need to max out your toughness here. I'm going to take a knife. So already in my head, I'm going to aim for the Grey Dawn Slaughterhouse, go out that way. And then worst case scenario, maybe we could do Fuse, but only as a distraction. Oh, okay, one of them's coming down. Wait. Good. Right, backstab. No, okay. Okay. <laughs> I don't know what's happened. Are we, are we good? Are we good? We good. I actually got a bit scared there. Like, I couldn't see the progress of what's going on. All right, we good. Let's actually get... Oh, no. Almost got lost there. Come on. Oh, I need to close the door. I don't have time to close this. Just move ahead. And Grandpa's going to scream. Lovely. That's just what we need. I've got to be very careful of Johnny's damage here. Not to be underestimated at all. You can't be taking any hits from him at all. Right, so he's there. Okay. Right, good thing they're not on comms, I guess. Oh, mate, we're going to have to dupe him. Let's try it. I'd rather have Sissy chasing me at the minute. Actually, don't mind her. She's normally got low damage if you take hits off her. Okay, let's try and dupe her with the ability. Let's do it. Try and go around her like this. There we go. This is a perfect example of the ability, by the way. we just got to play this really smart. She's probably going to check every bush and then rotate back around. Wait for it. Oh, come on, please go to the left side here. No, okay, okay, careful. I've got to sprint a little bit. I'm not sure if they can hear the sprint that well. Wait. Oh, my God. <laughs> We're doing her so bad. Yeah, she's going to leave area. She's going to check pretty much all them bushes and go, yeah, he's gone. Wow. I wasn't too sure on the sprinting, like, how loud it is. Maybe she's just saying, got a good headset. I'll take it. Okay. Again, guys, the power of Sunny's ability. Do not ever underestimate it. Let's actually go. All right, someone's already opened door here. Nice. This could be an easy battery escape here. Let's go for toolbox. No. 
That's... Man, I just really wish they didn't put, like, objects near the toolbox. I always end up accidentally picking them up. It's quite annoying. I'm going to keep the health potion. Now. I don't want to let this actually go to waste. Oh, oh it's all open. Oh, are we good? No, we really good here. I'm guessing... Yep, Connie's here. Okay. Question is, does she have a lockpick for the last gate there? I need to check it. Let's stay still for a sec. It'd be quite cool if you got notifications, though. Like, if something just popped up, like, oh... So and so's opened the battery exit or the battery exit gate, whatever. I mean, if no one's on comms and it's solo queue, you just, you know what I mean? You don't know what's open. Right, okay, it is good. All right, Connie's just left. She ain't playing behind. I'm just going to stay here for a second. Give me that little bit of HP there. But I do think this perk that you put on to counter Sissy could be quite good, especially if she's purely focused on you. Okay, Joey. I mean, Did you even see Anna run past, man? Well, okay. Let me come here. I want to heal you. Give me, give me the rest of my points, please. Even though I'm max level, I don't care. Just there you go. Take it. There you go. Goodbye. You guys can mess about on that exit gate. You know, for my last video, I'm not messing about. I'm out. I am out of there. Right, that was a pretty good little dupe on Sissy, though. Oh god. What are they doing? What? No. Oh no. Yeah, we know what's going on here. Is she trying to twerk for the Johnny? Get me in a damn next game. In fact, she got family ass this time. There we go. Don't ask about the perks, all right? I know we don't have a sissy on the team, but I want to max this perk out. That's what I've got to do half of these games. I'm just leveling the perks up while trying to use other stuff. Like, just, no. Leland, listen, man. I've not got high proficiency, man. You're going to be waiting. You're going to be waiting a long time. They probably think I'm trolling. I'm not. I've got absolutely no points in it. Well, there we go. I'll take the one. Don't even get angry. Might need these charge later on. It is a Johnny and a Cook. So, mm, is it a Fuse game? Yeah, it's either Fuse or I just jump out of window. I think jumping out of window might be better. You've got to be a little bit careful, I guess, because if you jump out of window on this map and Johnny's nearby and he's near you, you don't even have enough time to escape. You'd have to be someone like Anna. You're not eating that damage otherwise. Let me tell you that. I'd like to think that some of you guys have already learned all of the basement now. Every single route to take. Don't open up some of these spots here. They've already woke him up. That is a cool space that always needs to be open. Ooh, is that Johnny? I think someone did actually come down there. I need to be very careful. I'm not running something like no cell here. And it is sunny. You are going to get free hitted and you're out. I think when I still didn't even know the basement, I think there were still parts of it that I couldn't navigate around. And like, I think I was 60. I was still level 60. And some guy was telling me off. He was like, man, you should know where the basement exit is. I was like, oh, I don't. All right, my brain don't work like that sometimes. It takes me a little bit while longer to learn maps. Some people just don't understand that, do they? All right. This could be a window game. It's getting bush quickly. There we go. I do get a little bit scared with this. I know you can move in a bush, but I think... Look, you, you're on the edge of that bush. You're getting spotted. I don't think they saw that, though. Right, that's that one ping for granddad. Okay, cook's in my case. No worries. I'm not too scared of cook. I know that cook does pretty decent damage, though. Is it going to be a window game? Let's take the health potion. We're going to need this. See ya! Ooh! Look at that. Stunt double. Coming into play. You can use your ability as well and see if one of them's coming outside, but it doesn't look like it. Oh, we good. Wow. You guys going to really give me an easy game like that, are you? Where's Johnny? That's the only problem, by the way, if Johnny goes to basement. If you slip upstairs really quickly, jump out window, you know, he's nowhere to be seen. That's easy escape for one of you. Depends how quick you get out of basement. Oh, no. He's coming. He's coming. Oh, wait, wait, wait. We got this. We got this. All right. Wait, you're too slow. I'm curious if that was scout or not. Oh, mate, no. Wait. Cook, come on now, bro. You know I can see you. Right, let's just go to the back exit then. You know what I mean? That's what some people think. They think, oh, where's he going? Left or right? No, I'm just going out of here. I'll see you later, Cook. You can uh, keep waiting there for a minute. <laughs> Let's try and slip off. If we can get further into these bushes, like he's going to have absolutely no clue where I am. Wait. Oh, no. Oh, he definitely see me there. Wait. Oh, I'm pretty sure he's seen me. Wait. Let's see. Might have duped him there. I should have been a little bit quicker. Oh, yeah. He definitely sees me, man. He, wait. 
I knew it, you old man. You knew where I was, didn't you? Now, we do have jump start for the stamina. Oh, no, left face. Okay. Yep. We're going to back out on that plan. Well, at least two of them are chasing me right now. Have to still play it pretty safe. I mean, look at my HP. Just from taking a few hits from Cook. It's not good. Still back up. I mean, is he going to try and turn the gen off or what? I don't know. Maybe Leatherface is guarding the exit. I'm going to stay here for now. See, even with the increase of range, it doesn't go too far, the ability, but it's so good. Right, let's move here. This is proper out of the way. Although I hate it when it's daytime. You're just a lot easier to spot in the bushes. Let's get over. Pretty sure he didn't see me. Oh, he did. Okay. Oh, man. I, you know, it's just timing. Should have just sat in the bush. Yeah, go on. Go on, you, you old... You old fuck. You always got to hit me, ain't you? Absolutely dish damage at me there. Jump over. Let's regain my stamina again. If the generator is still turned off, I might be able to go to the exit. Just a bit scared if the leather face is lingering. Cook's going to be definitely behind me here. Can't really stop. Wait. Yep. Knew it. Of course. Right. Oh my god. Good. Let our stamina regen here. you got to make sure you time this perfectly. You want your stamina to regen as much as it can and slip off. Oh, the, mate, the range. The range. you got to be careful with that hitbox. I honestly thought I was out of range there, but somehow his dirty little broomstick seemed to have poked me. Okay. Oh, mate. You might have straight my health. <laughs> I'm on one hit here. I might have to go down well and reset, maybe. There's normally a health potion here. Okay, sweet. I mean, I'm fine with this. If Cook wants to chase me about, let's do it. Open up the tool space. Right. Oh, do you know what? If he was quicker there, he might have actually been able to get me. Look at the HP. Ooh. Could have played out there. Okay, I don't think I'm going to be able to dupe him. Might have to reset and go for maybe Fuse. Closing the cool space. I'm not really worried about the cook at the minute. It's just more if someone else comes over. But they're not in a party, so you can get away with stuff like this. There we go. He thinks he's slick, did he? He thinks, I don't know. Like, bro, you know how my ability works. I'm going to recharge it. Right. Let's go. Oh. Mate, we've actually done him. We have absolutely done him. Let's go. Wait for it. Right, we're good. Let's go. And left face is there. Oh, my. What's the timing? It's the midi timing, isn't it? Every time I slip off. Someone else is on my case. It's got to be a fuse game here. I'm going to guess that they're going to be rotating outside. But two of them outside. I'm guessing that gives everyone else enough space to actually do a fuse here. Or even back exit, maybe. Or the back gate. Let's get some bone knife. I know I could be doing with a different perk here, yeah? I'm leveling up the sissy perk. I know what you guys are going to say. Oh, Mini, why? There's no sissy in the game. Why you got a sissy back on? Listen, I've got to level them up. Do you think I want to sit here and grind out these perks that have no use? No. If I have to grind out every damn character. Let's open up the basement exit door. It might be an easy fuse game if they stay outside. Let's take a time with this. I was actually thinking of something the other day. You know when you go upstairs and there's that back window that you can jump out of? If Cook locks the back blue door and you jump out of that window... You can just instantly go to the gate and then, you know, pick that one lock and get it. But you need stunt double to obviously recover quick enough. And I was thinking, imagine if you could get stunt double on Connie. You could jump out that window, recover, use her ability, and then you're instantly out of that gate. You know, that's clearly why they've not put it on her. It'd be pretty broken. So that could be a reason why some of you guys padlocked the back gate instead of, you know, the little blue door. Maybe I'll do that one day. Have a lock pick. Very good. Well. Go take the fuse. Oh, I think someone DC'd. They've all DC'd. Come on now. You know, the party was only getting started. I don't know why some of them DC. Gotta like, we're, st <laughs> we're still in the ass. What causes people just to go, nope, we're done here. Goodbye, guys. Come on, let me escape. Let me get my escape points, but they don't want it. It's quite rare to see killers like all DC. But victims, oh man. Victims are DC in every single game. And some of them are crashing it as well. I end up coming against really high levels, beating them, and then they just DC and the whole game crashes. Like, come on. Let's get into another game. All right, let's do it. I've actually got gas station this time. But I've changed my perk this time. We've put Sanguine Shadow on. <laughs> Sanguine. Oh, God. My pronunciation ain't good, is it? I'll tell you what I used to say as well. You know that game? Dynasty Warriors? Yeah, I used to quit Dynasty Warriors. Yeah, I bet that, I bet that hurts you a little bit, doesn't it? I bet that makes you mad. Good. 
Fuck you. Yeah. The queer thing weird. <laughs> Die nasty warriors. Right, let's get a bow knife here. It could be a fuse game. I normally go for Valve every single time on this map, so let's roll. It's just kind of a shame that a lot of these perks are actually bugged, or you have to actually get them to level 3. But one of my friends was telling me that a lot of the victim perks have no downside to them, whereas the family perks actually do. Scout's a really good example. When it's level 1, you get like a 30% damage reduction while you're trying to level it. I do feel like it's a bit dumb. Like, why should you get punished trying to level up something? Oh, I don't know. But it's the victim perks, you know. There ain't no downside to them. That's where some of you might say, oh, well, what are you, Midi? A victim or a family main? Neither. I play both. That's how you got to learn the game the best way possible. Just through playing victim alone for all of this time, I can now rotate the basement really easy with Leatherface. And because I play Hitchhiker all the time, I know roughly where people are going to be putting their traps. It's like that. You know I mean, you've got to get the knowledge from both sides. Let's take our time here. They do have a cook, so I'm just being a little bit wary. Okay, that's, was that the hitch? I did just briefly see him. Obviously, Granddad's in there too. Let's cut this down. Nicely done. I do kind of miss using Jump Start and True Slight with Sunny, but listen, I'm all for using quirky perks. And I see the trap right there. That's what I'm saying, guys. Literally what I just said. Common trap spot. Where to put it? But a lot of the time, if you're using Bomb Squad, you just get rid of it. Bang. I like putting him in between. Yeah, you see that one there? Near the gap. Oh! oh my god, we're going to be taking a bit of damage here, boys. I have to dupe the cookout a little bit. So obviously, I can't go through that gap over there just because he's put a trap. Come on! Come on! Jesus Christ! Beating me down! Let's take the valve. Come on! Come on! Oh, he, oh, he ran out of stamina. Good. Have that. Let's heal back up here. That's what I'm saying, guys. Don't underestimate Cook's damage. I think someone said that before. Like, Cook's a god. He doesn't have to attack. Like, mate, if you max out your savagery quite a lot, you can take some dirty damage. Oh, there we go. Let's get into my favorite hiding spot. The car. Now, the good reason with the car, if you guys don't know, is only a chaser can get down here. So if they have no chaser, there's not a hitch or a sissy, you can just sit in here. <laughs> you can have the whole team just, like, camping you. You'll be fine. Well, until you bleed out, I guess. Okay, Cook's kind of left area here. I'm praying that the valve's actually spawned in the corner. Wait for it to take a time here. Yes. Okay, perfect. I'm just going to get this started. Sometimes what I like to do, turn the valve on and then just run off. By the time they turn it off, it's like halfway anyway. Just come back, switch it on. Good distraction. Stay for a sec. Okay, left face is coming over here. We good. I'm pretty sure he saw me, but I don't have a bone scrap. Stick hell pushing here. Let's hide in the corner for a sec. Like, I don't know if that's pick locked at the bottom there, and I'm not going to have enough time. So, I'm just going to wait for a second. Activate the ability. Ooh, so, hey, someone's coming up. A lot of the time with killers, as soon as you turn that valve on, one of them are going to stay over here. That's why just turning it on and moving to another objective is good. I'm going to play it a little bit safe here. Wait for him to disperse. We'll turn it back on. Oh, I see Cook. Listening, we good. Just stay crouched. You can't hear me, Cook. Your ears ain't big enough, mate. You're going to have to give me a little bit of time here. This is what you got to do sometimes. It's like Metal Gear Solid. Let them pass. Let them sweep the area. As soon as they move. There we go. Now's our time. It's all about patience, man. Is the key to winning sometimes. Right, here we go. Turn it off. He's still got time to turn that off, so let's go downstairs quickly. We've got to be really quick. Come on. Brush it down. Get one bow knife. We ain't going to take two here. Don't need two. Yeah, he's definitely turning it off. This is going to be very close. Come on. Come on. Eat it. Ooh. Wait, what's the valve on? Uh, I just see the arrow. It's on green. That should be enough. And I'm out of stamina. I could, oh, no. The exit's open. Oh, oh we, we need to go car. We need to just sit in here. Wait for our stamina to go back up. Goodbye, Cook. 
Cookie has just been outplayed. Let's wait for the stamp to go back up. Right, left face is there. I don't know if on comms and he's just saying something to him. They could just block me. But never faces move. Keep track of him. Let's go. We ain't got time to wait, man. We gotta go. Oh, nothing here. He's coming, oh, he's coming. Move. We got it. Come on! At. Oh my god. That was the pinnacle of Sonny's ability there. Well, that's pretty much the games with Sonny and reaching max level 99. Will I ever touch grass? Who knows? See you a lot later.